So hello YouTube, today I'm gonna show you a video of me trying to explain you how to make an actual Trojan virus in batch language, okay? Uh, actually that's not a Trojan uh, virus because Trojans are mostly written in C++ or uh, actually C uh, or even Java using Eclipse sometimes. Um, we're gonna make a Trojan like thing, okay? So, first thing we're gonna do is open Notepad. Um, for advanced users, I would recommend um, uh, writing the Trojan virus, uh, the Trojan algorithm in Notepad because uh, it has more options and it can make uh, it can actually make your virus look. Uh, more dangerous. Okay, uh, I'm gonna write it in uh, Notepad plus plus. Okay, so I'm gonna click on it. Any version you have. That yeah, okay. So first thing we're gonna do is go to language and select batch because this language, uh, this language that we're gonna uh, write the algorithm. Okay. Uh, it's really important do not forget that okay batch so next thing we're gonna do is type in echo off this really important here then we're gonna press type in then okay Google.com start http slash on Facebook http vid dot com medium pdf dot start HTTP slash slash uh, sorry mail by swan dot com test eighty six K oh sorry KL um do F sorry X and uh, P A Dot exec executable file. Okay, start. Um, sorry. HTTP slash slash um, nova dot co dot n um slash do dot exec executable file again. And now uh, I have a lot of websites malicious websites actually uh, in my mind but uh, to make this video less boring I will skip them up okay Th next thing we're gonna do is type in start HTTP slash slash antivirus on dot com and then start HTTP um, google dot com and then start youtube.com and then start oh sorry um you can type in uh youtube.com but uh because i've typed into here http i will do this again okay but you can skip this okay if you want to uh, you cannot uh, skip this right here. HTTP, 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 and HTTP. These um, uh, letters here cannot be, you know, skipped. Otherwise, uh, the wires won't work properly. HTTP. And now, um, what website? Um, for example, Facebook again. And now we're gonna press portal start 
remember you must uh, type in start here as you have start there okay now uh, I'm gonna explain to you why I've uh, written here these websites look um, these two websites and these two again are not uh, infected or malicious at all as it is and but uh, these websites right here with Google included uh, have uh, malware okay and when we uh, visit these websites malware will start to be downloaded okay so I'm using these websites before uh, because if um, the compromised computer uh, is controlled by a uh, you know uh, an expert he will notice that uh, this is a uh, malicious website and he's gonna close his browser okay before the malware is downloaded so I'm using these websites here uh, in order to uh, trick him okay and he will oh he'll say okay that's Google it's not mal malicious at all so I'm gonna keep this um, the tab here to make the virus more strong I'm gonna uh, type in to start and now uh, you must uh, type in here the name of the virus okay uh, so uh, you know uh, type in whatever you want that but uh, remember you must uh, type in that but but this over here uh, is optional you can put whatever name you want as long as it ends uh, that bad okay so I'm gonna uh, type in virus for this instance okay and then I must press start note had that and then start cmd that okay this will make the system too slow okay and uh, the user of the compromised computer won't have a chance to uh, do things okay in order to reverse our virus okay a frozen virus actually but that doesn't matter at all okay ne next thing we're gonna do is press type in cd and C okay then we're gonna press RD uh, which means remove directory um, C windows okay this step over here is too dangerous and of course too sad because if the windows uh, directory folder is uh, deleted the uh, compromised computer won't have the chance to boot again okay uh, so if you want you can st uh, skip this step over here okay uh, and then you must uh, press uh, type in a remember this on it okay and now MD which means uh, make directory folder one uh, so one MD folder two okay and now now wait folder three folder four and folder five uh, before doing typing in this uh, you can actually uh, type in c uh, cd see again if you want to uh, but you can skip this step too okay now we're gonna press go to uh, go to 8 okay then uh, let's go again then we're gonna type in cd uh, what was it um, user profile uh, actually, uh, if you know uh, the user profile name of the compromised computer, you can type this in. For example, uh, my mine is admin, so I'm gonna press admin if uh, I want to destroy my computer. But no, 
if you don't know the uh, username user profile uh, of the username of the compromise computer you can uh, rather leave. Type in this user profile, okay, and then start new. Then programs. Then start up, okay. Now I'm gonna press Dell. That's okay. This is gonna delete everything, and I, I'm, g I'm then gonna press, type in Y, and that's why because when I open command prompt and press Dell, it will ask for configuration. Uh, I'll type this, uh, you know, for this instance because I don't want all my files to be deleted. But uh, now with this virus, when we press Dell. Uh, everything this means everything in batch language it will say yes and all the files of uh, the store top um, folder will be deleted okay and then if exist uh, actually no uh, you have to press again CD C then you must press if exist um, virus that bot. Oh, sorry, virus that bad. Copy virus that bad. Um, Copy the virus that bad at um, C. Sorry, C. Program C. Data. Sorry, Microsoft. Then again. I'm uh, uh, wait, uh, start menu and then start up. Basically, you have to put this desk like this, okay? I'm sorry for the delay, and this command over here will. Um, you know, um, copy the virus or virus uh, into the startup folder, and whenever the system boots, uh, if it is able to boot, because if we uh, type in this command over here, it won't boot. Um, uh, but uh, we'll um, corrupt every time uh, the user tries to boot. What? If the computer won't be able to boot. Okay, and uh, I told you before that you can skip this, skip this uh, command over here because it's too dangerous and too expensive. Because the user will have to buy genuine Windows or whatever operating system to uh, manage to see his computer again. Okay. Next thing we're gonna do is um, pop up a message to his computer. So we're gonna type in MSG, and now, uh, for example, Windows Security Cent Center has detected a Trojan that in your system in your system uh, now again MSG to delete the 
Rose Ninja uh, from Mott or your uh, hard drives. This will look like the like the message pop up pop ups of Microsoft. Okay. Now next thing we're gonna do is type in CD uh, again uh, user profile make sure you type it correct and then desktop desktop and then Dell everything and then press Y again and then you must press task kill uh, explorer task kill I explore okay and then you have to sh press it down Path S oh, T okay it's a nasty pretty nasty virus Trojan virus actually I told you you can skip this step over here I'm going to okay because I don't want my windows to be deleted <coughs> and then uh, you're gonna have to uh, press in language batch okay and then you must go to file uh, save us you have to press here the uh, name that you have uh, put here here and here okay so for this instance virus that bad okay now save us virus that bad okay you must go uh, press this batch file that bad decimd don't uh, empty and save it as virus that bad um, now desktop I'm gonna save the desktop and press save now if we go here we'll see uh, our um, virus popping up here, wait, where is it? Uh, sorry, why did I save it? Save, yes, but where is our oh, right here? This is our virus, okay? So, uh, please subscribe and uh, like this video and write a comment if you want to, okay? But Really important, subscribe, okay, and I will make uh, new tutorials on how to uh, make strong neutrons and virus using uh, C language or even Java and combining it into Eclipse. Okay, so bye bye for now.